Rapunzel. Once upon a time, there lived a husband and a wife. The couple had a long-awaited baby. The pregnant wife looked at the garden next door every day. The wife couldn't take her eyes off the fresh lettuce. Fresh and green lettuce looks so delicious. If I could munch and crunch, have just one bite. But I can't. It's a witch's garden. She gives me a big fright. I just have to endure it, even if I want to eat. The wife became sick because she wanted to eat lettuce so much. The husband sneaked into the garden and took some lettuce, but he was caught by the witch. I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. My pregnant wife wanted to eat your lettuce. Have mercy on me. <laughs> you poor thing. May your baby be born healthy and fine, and then the baby will be mine. The husband nodded without realizing what he was doing. Soon after, the couple gave birth to a pretty daughter. However, as soon as they were about to become one happy family, the witch came. You stole my precious green lettuce. Now I will take your precious baby in return. <laughs> the witch named the child Rapunzel, which means lettuce. The witch locked Rapunzel away in a tower in the forest when she turned twelve. There were no doors or stairs in the tower. Whenever the witch wanted to climb the tower, she shouted like this: "Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down, let down your hair." Rapunzel's hair comes down, softly comes down to the ground. Hold on to Rapunzel's hair, climb up, climb up this ruby stair, climb up. Rapunzel was alone in the high tower most of the time. She was lonely. Whenever she was lonely, she sang a song. Outside this tower, I wonder what's out there, and my song can be heard by others elsewhere. A prince from a neighboring country heard Rapunzel's song while passing through the forest. What a beautiful voice! I wonder who she is. The prince tried to enter the tower, but he couldn't find the door. But the prince came to the forest and listened to the song. One day, the prince saw the witch climb the tower. Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down, let down your hair. The prince waited for the witch to come down again. When the witch left, the prince shouted the same. Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down, let down your hair. Rapunzel's hair comes down, softly comes down to the ground. Climb up to the tower that's higher than the trees. Who would Rapunzel be? Who would it be? Rapunzel was surprised to see the prince. The prince spoke gently. Don't be afraid. I'm the prince of the neighboring country. Please hold my hand now. Won't you come with me? Yes, I want to leave this prison. Would you bring me some silk threads, please? If I make a rope, I'll go down with ease. I want to live with you, and I want to live with you. Whenever the prince brought some silk threads, Rapunzel and the prince had a good time. Then one day, 
the witch came back to Rapunzel. Rapunzel pulled up the witch by letting her hair down. It's odd. You're smaller than the prince, but it's much heavier to pull you up. What? A prince? How dare you meet a prince behind my back? Chop, chop, I'll cut your hair. I'm going to cut all of your hair so that you'll never meet the prince again. I'm going to put you away, far away. The prince had no idea that Rapunzel was thrown out of the tower. When the witch let down Rapunzel's hair, the prince climbed up without knowing anything. The moment the prince reached the top of the tower, the witch dropped the hair that she was holding. Ha! You will never see Rapunzel ever again! The prince fell straight down to the ground. He managed to save his life. But he lost his sight because his eyes were poked by a thorny vine. Oh, Rapunzel, where are you? The prince wandered around the world to find Rapunzel. But he couldn't find Rapunzel anywhere. Then, one day, he heard a beautiful song. Oh, my dear prince, where are you? I miss you, I sing every day, I hope you hear my song. It was Rapunzel's voice that the prince desperately looked for. The prince fumbled and followed the song. Rapunzel, are you my Rapunzel? Rapunzel couldn't stop crying, she shed tears of joy. Oh, Rapunzel's precious tears are falling on my face. My world was once dark, but now it's a bright place. Oh, now I can't see Rapunzel's beautiful face. The prince took Rapunzel to his kingdom. Oh, Rapunzel, my dear Will you marry me? I've been waiting for this moment for years Yes, I will We are We are together Forevermore Rapunzel and the prince gave birth to twins And lived happily ever after Chippy Choo!